Rising damp gets a bad rap and it's often because it's misdiagnosed. Rising damp is actually fairly rare in a building, but what we do see in buildings is water at the bottom of a wall. Now, that water can be there for many different reasons. It could be because the soil is bridging the wall on the outside. It could be because there's a plumbing leak inside. It could be because there's condensation. It could be because there's the wrong plaster on the wall. It's always important to diagnose the damp properly. We often get calls, we've had our rising damp fixed three times. My answer is always, well then it's not rising damp. So if it is rising damp, once you fix it, it should not come back. If you're using the remedial treatment for rising damp on a plumbing leak, it will not fix it. If you're fixing a wall for rising damp where the soil is higher on the outside than it is on the inside, then it will not fix it. It is important to get it diagnosed correctly. 60% of your body is water and your building shouldn't be.